Obama seemed to compare the political climate in the U.S. to that of pre-war Germany as he spoke to the 1,800 crowd. Barack Obama appeared to hint at a comparison between the U.S. under Donald Trump's presidency to the rise of Adolf Hitler during a speech. He did not mention Trump by name while speaking at the Economic Club of Chicago on Tuesday, but mentioned Germany in the 1930s, warning U.S. democracy could fall apart. Reuters to Barack Obama appeared to hint to a comparison of the U.S. under Donald Trump to pre-war Germany in the 1930s the former president told the audience. We have to tend to this garden of democracy, or else things could fall apart quickly. That's what happened in Germany in the 1930s, which despite the democracy of the Weimar Republic and centuries of high-level cultural and scientific achievements, Adolf Hitler rose to dominate. Sixty million people died. So you've got to pay attention. Close quote. His comments, reported by Chicago Business, were interpreted by some as an attack on his successor, as he gave the talk as part of a wider warning for audience members not to take democracy for granted. AP colon Associated Press to some of Donald Trump's fans took offense at what they thought was a comparison Obama seemed to compare the political climate in the U.S. to that of pre-war Germany as he spoke to the 1,800 crowd. His comments came just a day before Trump made a historic announcement to officially recognize Jerusalem as the capital of Israel. The decision to do so overturned decades of official U.S. policy and sparked controversy and violent clashes in the Gaza Strip. This morning Trump vowed to undergo a full physical exam after it was claimed he slurred during a speech on America's policy in Israel. U.S. President Donald Trump says it is time to officially recognize Jerusalem as the capital of Israel most read in news my foots by your balls woman puts feet on man's train seat and brands him white idiot be alert how to avoid the winter vomiting because no offer us such a sweet schools and offices one punch K.O. brutal moment traveler knocks out man with single punch in car park brawl the big chill snow blankets that UK with 12 C Arctic blast set to last for 10 days third world NHS apostrophe anorexic teen starved to death after series of shocking failures hunt for rapist woman raped after being dragged into a transit van parked on a driveway the president appeared to say God bless the United States as he drew his speech to a close, sparking concerns for his health, and even suggestions he has dementia.